everyone and welcome to Lucidity's Toyscape. Today I am going to be opening these three Series 2 Smushy Mushy Doo Doubt Donuts bottles. I have one of each color. I have this cream beige kind of yellow color. I have this pink color and brown. So we're going to be opening one of each. And I'm also going to show you a trick to get the Smushy Mushy that you want without having to open the bottle. That means you can look and see who you're going to get before you purchase so you won't waste any money on a duplicate. And at the end of the video, I'll also be doing a giveaway, so please stay tuned for that. It'll be my first giveaway and I'm so excited for it. Today's shout out goes to Santa's Toy Testers. Please go check them out and subscribe they are so sweet and fun. I love watching their videos. It's always so it's always so enjoyable to watch their videos. So definitely go and um, subscribe to them and like their videos and comment. Anyway, moving on. So you might notice that this bottle is a little wonky looking. That's because it might already be open. And I can tell you the reason for that. The reason for that is I have no willpower because I, <laughs> the pink bottles are what really got me this series. I was really looking for someone specific, so I had a lot of trouble finding her. I went to so many stores. Let's count how many stores I went to. So, okay. I went to one Parkinson's. I went to one Toys R Us, and then I went to another Parkinson's somewhere else, and then somewhere else I went to Hamley's, and then I went to another Toys R Us somewhere else, and then somewhere else I went to another Parkinson's, and another Hamley's, and finally at that seventh store that I went to, I finally found who I wanted using the trick that I'm going to show you in a bit. It took so long to find her. I love her so much. So I had to open her in the car on the ride home. Don't worry, I was the passenger. I wasn't driving while opening it, I promise. And I also, well, okay, I'll show you the trick first so that you can understand what I'm going to talk about. So for this trick, you're going to need a flashlight. And I... I tried doing it with an actual flashlight, but it doesn't really work so well, so I would suggest that you use the flashlight on your phone. This is a very old phone, so I'm sorry about it. I'm filming with my actual phone now, so this is just... Well, okay, so turn on the flashlight on your phone. Here's mine. And you're going to take the bottle, and you're going to put the flashlight here, like this. Do you see that shadow? I think you can see some kind of shadow there, right? So, if you look here, this white part at the bottom here, it's, it's see-through, the bottle see-through, so you can see this white part. This white part is actually the sticker, and the sticker has a picture of the smushy mushy pet that you'll be getting in the bottle. So without having to open it, you can actually shine your light right here at this edge and you might be able to see the shadow of what is on that sticker. It is actually very difficult to do, so it takes a lot of time. If you plan to do this, make sure you have a lot of time because you will be sitting there for hours. Well, maybe not hours. It depends on who you're looking for. So you're just going to turn it and turn it until you finally see something. You're going to want to turn the flashlight, you're going to turn everything. So if you can see, there's a little shadow right there. And you also have to be quite well versed in the Smushy Mushy's images that are on the stickers. Okay, so this is the part that really got me for this bottle. You can kind of see something black here. A little a little point and a white stripe through it and something light brown here. So I'm going to show you the checklist so we can see who that might be. So what we know is that 
The shadow shows us something black and white. The ones black and white here are Carrie Cow and Scout Skunk. Another thing you have to know about these bottles is which characters come in which bottle. I'll tell you right now which ones come in which bottle. In the brown bottle, you will either find a Tula Poodle or La Bella Lamb. So it's either going to be this little girl here or this cute little lamb. And in this yellow cream kind of bottle, you will either find Marnie Monkey, that's this guy, Scout Skunk, or Bela Bear, who's right there. So judging from all those things, it's, pro it's not going to, it's black and white. The shadow that we found was black and white and kind of pointy. So we decided that it would either be Carrie Cow or Scout Skunk. The Carrie Cow doesn't come in the cream bottle, she comes in the pink bottle. In the pink bottle, you can either find Carrie Cow, Chelly Chicky, or Kayla Koala. So it should be Scout Skunk in this bottle, since it is a yellow bottle, which Scout Skunk could come in, and it's black and white. And if you look at this little point thing, it's kind of pointy, and we saw a little bit of yellow there. So I'm going to put this here, and I'm going to show you again the shadow that we found. So there it is, I think. As I said, this can be quite difficult. Okay, so there it is. You can see a little point, a little black and white point there. And if you turn it like this, you can see something yellow right here. So keep this image in mind. And let's look back at the checklist. There it is, a black and white point and a little yellow donut thing. So this is probably going to be Scout Skunk, which is the last one I need from the cream colored bottles. So let's see. Let's check this one as well. So like I said, in the brown bottles, you can either get Petula Poodle, who I have right here, or Labella Lamb. So since I already have the Poodle, I'm looking for Labella Lamb. So let's look and see. Well, that was fast. If you look close, you can see a swirl. An orange and pink swirl. Some pink, some more pink here. That looks like a little ear. You can turn some more and see more things. There's something here as well. Kind of looks like another pink ear right there. The easiest thing to see when you use a flashlight trick is the title, the Smushy Mushy title. That's not very helpful. But if you see that, you know that if you turn it all the way around like this, this will be the top. So it does help a little bit. So this is the top, which means this little swirl and this little ear is at the top. Which means we can look and see who has a swirl at the top of her. So since the only ones that come in the brown bottle are the Tula Poodle and the Bella Lamb, we can see which one of them has the swirl. And it's definitely going to be the Bella Lamb. With this cute little orange and pink swirl, with this pink ear and this other pink ear. So we can safely say that this is probably going to be the Bella Lamb. Let's find the swirl again. There it is. It looks like her. Okay. Now put that back. I will also be showing you the same thing with this bottle, even though it's already kind of open. I'm just going to press this down. I'm going to press the packaging down so you can see that this really does work. Okay. Right immediately, we see something here. Can you kind of see like something pointy? Something pointy and gray. And here you can see something kind of black and white. And another pointy gray thing. And here you can also see that there's something on the pointy gray thing. It's kind of pink. So let's see who that could be. In the pink bottles, like I said, you will either get Kayla Koala, 
Charlie Chicky or Carrie Cow. So let's see which one I have. Pointy gray things. So she's gray, but there's nothing pointy. She's very round. She doesn't have anything gray, but Carrie Cow does. She has these horns. They're very pointy and gray. And around one horn is something pink. She has black and white ears. So let's look again. It's kind of hard to do with this packaging like this. Searching, searching. Okay, there it is again. You can see it. Something pointy, something black and white, and over here you can see it again. Something pointy with a donut around it. Doesn't that look a lot like Carrie Cow? So judging by what we have seen, we probably know who we're going to find in these bottles. So now it's time to open them up and see if I was right. I'm going to start with the pink bottle, which is who I think is going to be Carrie Cow. And I kind of know already because it's already open. But let's see if I was actually right about the flashlight trick. Take this packaging off. It's already open. And turn it to reveal. Da -da -da -da. Who's this? That's a little mouth. So let's open it and see. Here's a little bottle. It's red and pink. It has red and pink ball chains. Here's the bestie. Let's open up the bestie. It's so cute. It's strawberry milk. Squish. She's pretty soft. Put her there and reveal Carrie Cow. Here she is. It really is Carrie Cow. She is so precious and sweet, and I love her so much. She's very fun to squish. She's not super soft, but she's still very nice to squish. Something about her. So she comes with. Of course, she comes with her little name tag. She comes with a checklist. And she comes with the sticker. So let's say thank you so much to the sticker for helping us find who we went. Thank you, sticker. So here is the horns, the little donut, the ears that helped us find Carrie Cow. I'll put that there. So we found who we wanted. It took me so long to find Carrie Cow. As you can see, she's a rare. <laughs> and wow, she really is. She really is, you guys. Okay, so let's move on and see if I was right about the other two. So in the brown bottle, we have deduced that it is probably going to be La Bella Land. So let's open it up and see if I was right. If you didn't believe me for the first time with the cow because it was already open after all so I might have just tricked you but this one has never been opened so we'll find out if my trick really works if you're wondering if I have used this trick before I have actually only used it a few times because I only just found out about it I have used it on finding Bitsy Bunny from series 1 and these three I always have a lot of trouble opening these. I'm sure you all know that by now if you've seen any of my other videos. Okay. So let's turn the bottle and see through the window. It looks pink. It looks really light pink. 
So let's open it up. I think I'll move my camera down a little bit so you can see better. There's no point in it being so high up. So it has a cute little bottle. Inside we have two purple ball chains. Put that there. Now let's see who we got in here. Bestie. My scissors are a little dull. It's a donut. Oh, oh no. Look at that little dent in her head. That's okay. She's very soft. Very soft. And I love her colors, this purple and this pink. She looks really pretty. That dent is no matter what, just pretend. It's because of the little bite that was taken out of it. She's still beautiful. <laughs> so let's take out this guy. <gasps> Ta da! Oops, her name tag stuck to it. It really is La Bella Lamb. This, I thought this would be orange, but it's not. It's actually brown. In the picture, it looks more orange. But you know, that's fine. Because we got who I wanted. It's La Bella Lamb. She's very soft. Now she can join her friends. Let's put her here. With her bottle and her bestie. And here she gets her name tag and her checklist and her sticker. So let's say thank you again to the sticker. Oh my goodness. I did not know that that's what the sticker looked like. She looks so out of place. I wonder if all the stickers for La Bella Lamb look like that. Well, okay. <laughs> I mean, if they don't, then I got a very special sticker. Well, <laughs> she doesn't look centered. Well, anyway, we still found who we wanted. So last but not least, let's try this one. Now, this one was a little bit harder to figure out who it was. It wasn't as easy as the previous two. So, reminder again, we are hoping to find Scout Skunk. And it's all because of this tail and this donut. This time I'm going to open it up from the bottom. Happen staying when I'm looking at these. I mean, look at that. Okay, so I think you've already seen the window, but let's do a reveal anyway. Da -da. I mean, it looks black and white, so let's open. Oops, sorry. Anyway, let's open it up. Try not to knock into the camera again. Here's a little ball she comes with. There's a pink ball chain and a red ball chain. Put that there. Let's go ahead and open the bestie first. Wow, this guy is big. I was really not expecting it to be so big. But here it is. This is a little... Kind of pushed down a little bit, but that's okay. Here it is. This is so cute. It's not as soft as the other ones, but something's very satisfying about squishing it. Kind of, it's like very airy, but not so soft. So here's this guy. And now... We can see, is it truly the skunk? I mean, we already know, kind of. But, it is! It's Scout Skunk, with his beautiful, 
beautiful big tail, and this white stripe that helped us, his ears, this cute yellow donut that helped us. Here he is. It's kind of hard to see his eyes, but there they are. He is not as soft as other ones, I think. Well, his tail is quite soft. He is beautiful. I love him. So let's put him over here with his bottle and his bestie. His bestie is so big, there's not much space for him. And let's see what else he came with. Of course, he came with the name tag, the checklist, and the sticker. Once again, let's say thank you to the sticker for helping us. Thank you, sticker. So, all because of this, we found Scout Scum. All because of his tail. Kind of distracted, it's so shiny. You can kind of see my room in it. What am I doing? Okay, I was very distracted. I'm like a, I'm like a dog when I see a squirrel. Anyway, so because of all these stickers, we managed to find exactly who we wanted, and also because of my flashlight. So I would definitely suggest if you are not like. If you're not so excited like to have the mystery factor when you open a blind bag, if you just really want to get the ones that you want, if you're a collector, then I would definitely suggest that you do this trick. It does take a lot of practice to be able to really know what you're looking for. It takes a lot of background knowledge. If you met if you bring a checklist with you, it would be easier. So like first of all you might want to buy like one bottle. And if it's your first bottle, you'll definitely get someone new. And then you can use the checklist so that you will find the other ones that you want as well. You kind of have to know which ones come in which color bottle. You can easily find that out. You can look it up. You can listen to what I told you earlier in the video. You can write it down and remember it. If you check out the Swishy Pushy Wikipedia, you can find the information there as well. I am... Um, I am actually the creator of that Wikipedia, so you can know, definitely know that everything I put on there is pretty, pretty exact, pretty legit. So you will definitely be able to find out any information you need to know, especially what comes in what color bottle for every series. And if you bring the checklist along, you'll be able to refer to this when you use your flashlight on the bottom of the bottle and look at the sticker. You will probably be able to find everyone you want as long as they have it in stock. So now I'm going to tell you a little story about this guy. So I know that I already went to seven stores looking for Carrie Cow. And the reason why is because in the pink bottle you can either find Chili Chicky, Kayla Koala, or Carrie Cow. And Chili Chicky is ultra rare. And carry cow is rare. And the koala is not. Which means most of the pink bottles have a koala. He's right here, by the way. So it took me seven different stores to find a pink bottle that was not Kayla Koala. I looked at so many bottles, you guys. So many. And it was so hard to find anyone but Kayla Koala. And before I started using my flashlight trick, it would have been even harder. If I did not use my flashlight trick, I would have bought so many Kayla Koalas already. But luckily, I didn't. I only bought one extra one. And that is who I'm going to be giving away. So listen closely if you want to join this giveaway and get one Kayla Koala. Here she is. She has the bottle of her. She has the bestie. It's not even opened yet. And she's inside here with all her things. With her checklist, her name tag, and her sticker. Kayla Koala. She's brand new. So if you would like to win her in a giveaway, then I will tell you exactly what you have to do.
first of all, you have to be 18 or older for a heavy parent's permission to enter because you will have to be giving me your address so I can send this to you. This is an international giveaway, so no matter where you live in the world, I will still send it to you for free. The shipping will be free. And this is what you have to do. First, you have to subscribe to me because this is a giveaway for my subscribers to show my appreciation for them. So subscribe and then like this video and comment below and answer my question. Which do you like better? La Bella Lamb, Carrie Cow, or Scout Skunk? Which is your favorite out of those three? Just answer that below and then follow me on Instagram. I will give the link below in the description. And then you can follow my, when you follow my Instagram, you can look for the post on this giveaway. And if you want some extra entries, you'll find all the information on how to get extra entries on that post. But all you really have to do are those four steps and you will still be entered to win Kayla Koala here. Because I have this extra. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. And... Please do enter my giveaway. I'll be so happy if you do. Tell your friends. And yeah. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you find some useful information in this video. This flashlight trick can be used for Series 1, Series 2. Not for Series 3, I think, but maybe for Series 4. I'm not sure yet. I haven't seen any of those bottles yet. But you can definitely try it. So tell me if this trick works for you. Let me know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.